Hey creative, sometimes your idea is not going to work. That's just what happens. So what do you do for the idea that you can't pull together? One, it's not dead. Your creative ideas are never actually fully dead. If you absolutely cannot figure it out right now and trying to do so has you stuck, put it aside for a little while. Now, I'm not saying delete it. I don't mean throw it out. Do not trash it. Just put it aside for a little while like dough that's been overworked and let it rest. Meanwhile, you go on to work on other things. If you're not sure what, just Google prompts for whatever your art medium is, you know, writing prompts, drawing prompts, and, you know, start doing that. But while you're working on your inertia, here's the thing. That project that you put aside, it's still growing things. This is going to go in a couple of different paths for you. One, which is really fun, is when you realize why it didn't work and you're able to pull the thing up out of the ground and work on it again and refine it and actually finish it. And that is such a delight to do. The other thing is you realize that it has actually grown numerous sprouts that don't belong to the original project, but can in fact be used to flavor your new ones. You can still harvest characters, really great lines, descriptions, worlds, that particular kind of shading, that really fun chord progression. All those things are there. Those things that made you love the project that didn't work, they're still there. They don't die. It's just that later on down the road, you may realize it's not the project you thought it was. <laughs> Oh, you don't say. He's talkative today. I don't know. For example, my first OC original character I created at the age of 14, and his name was Alex. And at that point in time, he was the son of Dracula, and I had this really weird storyline that I can't fully recall. That story I loved to death. I worked it and worked it and worked it. It was the first time I'd actually printed up my original work and gave it tentatively to people, hoping that they would read the first three chapters. I invented a half-brother and a whole abusive family and this ecosystem in Scotland. It was nuts. That story never worked. But that's okay, because you know what? Alex has transformed. Now that my own universe has been developed, because I kept writing, now I know what Alex is. He's not the son of Dracula. Is as special as I wanted him to be, and he's going to be in the book after Knott's book. So that's, you know, down the road. But see, it took me more than 10 years to figure that out. I loved that story, but it just didn't work. And that's okay, because the stuff I got out of it, I have sprinkled throughout most of my published books. Nothing you work on actually dies. It either develops and just has to rest for a while, like dough rising before you put it in the oven, or else it grows other things, like an, an incredible ecosystem all on its own. Don't ever worry if you have to put a project aside. It is there for you, and it's going to give the rest of your work life one way or another. You can't lose. Now sit down with me, my fellow creatives, and let's make something new.